dude. 13 officers fired their weapons Monday. In a very, very tough situation. 54-year-old James Michael Skirvin. Ladies and gentlemen, rev up those engines because today's adventure takes us on a wild ride through the heart of Ohio. We're diving headfirst into the adrenaline-fueled saga of James Skirvin, police cruisers, and a dash of mystery. Buckle up. This isn't your grandma's Sunday drive. It's a high-octane thriller that'll leave you gripping the edge of your seat. Meet James Skirvin, a 54-year-old enigma with a lead foot and a penchant for chaos. His rap sheet? Well, it's as clean as a freshly waxed car hood. No criminal history, just a few minor traffic infractions in the Dayton area. But don't let that fool you. Skirvin's got secrets hidden under the hood. Our story kicks off at the Voyager Village trailer park in Trotwood. Assault report. Skirvin's accused of intentionally plowing his truck into his own daughter. A family feud with tires screeching and tempers flaring. Officers rush to the scene, adrenaline pumping. And there she is, the victim, shaken but alive. But wait, Skirvin's not done. He guns it, leaving officers in the dust. A long weapon pointed out the window. A real-life action movie unfolding on U.S. Route 35. Trotwood's finest give chase, sirens wailing, adrenaline surging, Skirvin swerves, taunting fate, and suddenly, it's a high-speed tango with oncoming traffic. Cue the helicopter shots. Multiple agencies join the pursuit, a symphony of flashing lights and roaring engines. Skirvin, like a fox in the headlights, pulls a U-turn at Abbey and US-35, but this isn't your average three-point turn. No, my friends, this is the moment when bullets fly. Skirvin's truck becomes a moving target and officers. They're ducking, weaving, and returning fire. It's a showdown on wheels. Hold on to your hats, folks. The plot thickens. Skirvin's brother spills the beans. Suicide by cop was on his twisted bucket list. Yes, you heard it right. Our mystery man was hoping for a high-stakes finale, a blaze of glory with flashing lights and sirens. But little did he know, fate had other plans. Cue the dash camera footage. An officer hurls stop sticks onto the asphalt, a desperate attempt to halt Skirvin's rampage. The sticks connect, but does our daredevil slow down? Not a chance. He barrels forward, tires shredded, adrenaline pumping. It's like a Hollywood blockbuster. Action, suspense, and a truckload of nerve-wracking tension. The chase hurtles toward its climax. The intersection of Liscombe Drive and US-35. Skirvin, like a comet on a collision course, zigzags across all lanes. And then it happens. Metal meets metal. His truck slams into a Trotwood police cruiser, and an unoccupied Montgomery County Sheriff's deputy's vehicle takes the hit. Hold out! Dude! It's chaos, smoke, and shattered glass. The showdown reaches its peak. Dayton Police, Trotwood Police, and the Montgomery County Sheriff's Office. A trifecta of law enforcement. Seven Dayton officers, four Trotwood officers, and two Montgomery County Sheriff's officers, all with their fingers on the trigger. Bullets fly, echoing off the pavement. Skirvin's long gun and another weapon. Evidence scattered like confetti. The Ohio skies tremble with the aftermath. And there you have it, my adrenaline-fueled compatriots. The dust settles, the sirens fade, and our mystery man lies wounded. The female victim, caught in the crossfire, survives, a testament to resilience. The Ohio Bureau of Criminal Investigation steps in, and internal probes commence. Justice, only time will tell. Be sure to like and subscribe and come back for the next thrilling episode.